We are making catfish oil from the viscera. Can you see how clean the catfish oil is? Can you see that? So I'm going to be cooking this on a very low heat for the next three hours for it to... You're welcome to the catfish farm. We are at the smokehouse and we've been processing a lot of catfish today. You know, we visited a catfish farm yesterday and we brought lots of catfish. We bought about 2,700 kilograms of catfish and we've been able to prepare them for smoking. This is the viscera that we got from the catfish. Over 200 kilograms of viscera and now we are making catfish oil from the viscera. Can you see how clean the catfish oil is? Can you see that? So I'm going to be cooking this on a very low heat for the next three hours for it to produce a clean catfish oil. Now, the oil comes from the viscera of the catfish. There are a lot of things that we get from catfish when we process, apart from the fact that we smoke the fleshy part of the catfish. There is the intestine, the big intestine. Some people call it gizzard. This is it. It has been cleaned and, you know, gutted. Can you see? This is the sack in which the catfish stores the food when you feed it. After gutting the catfish, we remove it from the belly of the catfish and we open it up in order to wash it. This is the only part of the catfish where catfish tastes just like meat. Can you see it? So these are going to be cooked and they are delicious when cooked. Why this is the viscera? This is where the catfish oil comes from. This is the main catfish. The sections, just the middle part of the catfish. We are preparing to, to dry this. We are taking them directly to the oven. They've been cleaned and cut into sections. So now let me show you where the viscera comes from, where the catfish intestine comes from, and also how we get the sections. So this is one out of the catfish that we harvested from the farm yesterday. Now let me put it on a scale for us to know the weight of this one. So this catfish weighs about six kilograms. And this is 12 month old catfish from juveniles raised by a farmer very close to me around here. And the farmer said he fed them for like 12 months from juvenile stage. Now you can see, this is an hybrid catfish, the one they call the Heteroclerus. This is what you get when they uh, crossbreed an Heterobranchus longifilis with Clarius garipinus. So this is the kind of catfish that gives lots of viscera where we get the catfish oil from. Now, let me show you. Now you take a knife, you cut open the belly of the catfish. Then you make another cut like this. Now this section, we are going to be raising it, raising the blood away. This section is the viscera. This is where the oil comes from. Why the, the intestine is like this, the food sack in the belly of the catfish. There is an edible part. This is the food sack. This is the edible part of the catfish where the catfish tastes just like meat. This is where the catfish stores food when it's being fed in the pond. When we turn it over, then we can wash thoroughly. Then it becomes just like meat. You see? So there are a lot of byproducts that we get from catfish apart from the main catfish itself. We get fish oil. We get this. Thank you.